Hi Floss Tube, it is Helen D. Uh, today is actually Thursday, January 19th. <laughs> I don't record on Thursdays. I wanted to come on and just talk to you for a few minutes about the upcoming sal that I'm doing with Carla at Cobweb Corner of Strawberry Fair by October House Fiber Arts. We've been talking about this um, for a couple videos now. Carla had everyone who was interested fill out a Google form so she kind of knew how many supplies to start out with. Those supplies are in. So I want to talk to you about ordering. I have some fabric choice examples to share. A lot of people have asked like, well, you know, do you have any suggestions for fabrics? Uh, and just kind of basic stuff. So the details. Strawberry Fair is this cute little chart. It was by October House Fiber Arts. It's fairly small. It is 91 by 62. Uh, this came out last year during one of the needlework expos. So I know some people already had it. You had picked it up then. And I've had a few people say, if I already had it, can I still join in? Absolutely. We know that some people have had this chart for six months and just hadn't gotten around to stitching it yet, as I do with many of my charts. <laughs> so. Yeah, if you already have the chart, pull some floss, join us. If you don't already have the chart, I'll tell you how you can get that with a discount from Carla. So the Strawberry Fair Sal, we're going to start this on um, Valentine's Day, February 14th, which I believe is a Tuesday. Yeah, it's a Tuesday. Tuesday, February 14th, Valentine's. The thinking was that way we'll have time to get it done and finished and ready to put out for spring. Although we've barely had any snow here this year, so it feels like spring already. <laughs> so, uh, so that is the chart. I am stitching mine with three of the called for Classic Colorworks flosses. And then I'm using the rest of the called for DMCs. It calls for uh, one, two, three, 10 fancy flosses, but I chose, just to kind of keep the cost down, I picked this brown, which the brown seems a little lighter than that, um, but it'll work for me. The brown, the pink, this brighter pink that's in like the flowers and it's also in the berry, and then the green, that's the topper and the leaves. So those are the three fancy flosses that I chose, and like I said, the others, I'm just using the given DMC conversion. So we're starting on the 14th. We'll be using the hashtag Strawberry Fair Sal, and it's fair with an E, because it's fancy. So hashtag Strawberry Fair S-A-L for stitch along or start along, however you like to think of it. Um, so if you need to order supplies, I'm gonna walk you through it. So hopefully this isn't filled with fingerprints. I didn't think about that. <laughs> So you can go to cobwebcorner.com, Carla's website, and in the search box, just search Strawberry Fair with an E because it's fancy. So when I type in Strawberry Fair, I can either hit the search or it just came up. So click on that. Okay, I want to make sure it was there. <laughs> so down here, she has the picture she has listed a picture of the back of the chart with the floss conversions and everything. And then you can order the chart. You can get the called for flosses. This may be backwards for you. If it is, I apologize. Um, or you can get what she's calling the Helen D conversion, which is the ones that I'm using. The three classic color works and the DMCs. So what you do when you're choosing what you want, from this listing of the chart, if you add this to cart, it includes a copy of the chart. So go through and you might be like, you know what, I'm gonna use the fancy floss. I already have three of these. So you just would click off, and I'll turn this back to show you. You would click off the ones that you need. If you decided you needed like a couple of those but you also wanted some DMCs, you can click those off too, okay? And then you would do add to cart. And that will add all of that to your cart. 
So it's processing, thinking. Okay, so now you could continue shopping if you have other things to add. If you're ready, if this is all you need, uh, hit view cart. And the way to make sure that all the stuff is in there because it's all kind of bundled in together. Right here, it says view, hide, right here, view, hide options. If you click that, that will show you all the things you clicked off. So it includes a copy of the chart and all of the flosses that you clicked off. And then down there, it will have your total cost. So then if you scroll down a little more, uh, coupon code slash gift certificate, hit the little down arrow. And right there is where you will type in the code, which is strawberry all one word well it is only one word so strawberry and hit apply and then it will break it down for you and you'll see right there there's your amount and then there's your discount so it's 10% off and an additional 10% off because she already has things listed at a discount of the chart plus whatever of the flosses on that listing that you chose so again it says you know there's your coupon code you can see right there it says discount then you would go to proceed to checkout and fill out your shipping information and all of that stuff um, it's really important that you inst that you put in the coupon code before you check out because once you've checked out there's not much she can do um, I was going to show you one more thing she has all kinds of flosses in stock the charts right now she has 55 um, Carla is working directly with Robin at um, October House to get charts in real quick. So if she runs out, she can get them in real quick. If the chart is out of stock, it's not going to show. <clears throat> All right. Hold on. <laughs> if the chart is out of stock, it will show up as you know, zero in stock. I'm trying to find something that is out of stock so that I can show you. Um, if it's out of stock, it shows up as zero in stock. And then right under there, everything's in stock, Carla. <laughs> right under there, it would say add to wish list. Uh, so that if you, needed it you could add it to your wish list and that kind of flags it to Carla to show her that she needs to order some more of those so she's keeping an eye on that real close so that um, she can get right in touch with Robin and if she needs things um, they can get shipped quickly literally everything I'm, everything is in stock so you'll have to just take my word for that, that if you need that, it would say add to wish list. Um, and that's where it would be. Yeah, every, every, literally everything. Oh, here's one, here's one. It's a waiting list, it's not a wish list. So, oh my gosh, electronics. So if it comes up as zero in stock, right under this, it says, put me on the waiting list. So then if you click on that, you would just fill out your name and email and phone number so that when it's back in stock, she can let you know. So put me on the waiting list, not the wish list. She has a wish list so that if you want to keep track of things that you might want to purchase later, that's what that is. But the waiting list is if you need her to order more and then get them in. So I hope that made sense. So the code is strawberry. I will link that below as well. So fabrics, uh, I've had several people say, you know, what are you using for your fabric? Do you have any suggestions? I'm looking for something creamy. This is done on Weeks Dye Works um, Baby's Breath Linen, which is a pale, pale, pale pink. Um, I don't have any of that color. I don't stitch on linen. So <laughs> I was looking, I looked through my scrap bin I didn't really have anything the right size. 
So I, now I'm gonna have to cut something. <laughs> but I have five, I brought five things to kind of show. Hopefully the lighting's decent. So the first one is Fiber on a Whim Cream and Sugar, and mine is a 14 count Ada, which is just a really pale, creamy, super, super pale yellow, creamy fabric. So this, right now, this is my top choice. So there's that one. This one is kind of my top choice, except I don't have a small piece, and um, I don't wanna cut it. This is Picture This Plus Bramble, which is kind of a grayish, pinkish, the colors look great on it. Like, I'm so tempted to cut this, but it's the only piece I have. And I didn't, I can't get any more. So that one's great. Picture this plus Bramble. That piece happens to be a 16 count Ada. Another picture this plus Ada that a couple people I've seen have chosen to use and posted is um, Murmur. That's also like a creamy, has a little pink in it. Um, I actually ordered a small cut of that from 123 Stitch, but it hasn't come in yet. So that's another option. Um, here's a Lugana option. This is straight up cream. Straight up cream, cream Lugana. The colors would be great. This happens to be a 32. And then I actually have two linen options, surprisingly, though I don't stitch on linen. These happen to be in my stash. This first one is Vintage Sahara Belfast Linen. And it's a little yellowy, yellowy creamy. And then the last one is uh, Barb's Blend which is also just kind of a, a creamy yellowy. So that's what I'm looking for. I had a couple people say, oh, I, found, I have this pale pink. What do you think of that? Great, that sounds like a great choice. Um, honestly, the colors would look great on a nice pale gray. I'm gonna hold these up all together. So this is a great small project to kind of be a bit of a, Bit of a stash buster, but any kind of light neutral, I think honestly would, would, would work great with these colors. So that's kind of the details. Um, you know, ordering information. She's got a little setup. She posted, Carla posted on Instagram yesterday that she has like a little setup in her studio of just Strawberry Fair supplies so that when an order comes in, she can go right down the line, snag everything she needs, pop it in the mail. Uh, and I know several people say they've already gotten theirs. She gave the people that filled out the form kind of advance notice, um, but now we're ready to just go wild. If you wanna join us and you need supplies, she has them for you. So I think that's it. <laughs> if you're having a problem ordering, you can always, there's a contact me, so you can contact Carla and contact her before you order. Uh, and if for some reason she runs out of charts and has to get more in, so it says zero when you put yourself on the waiting list, I would hold off on ordering so that then when you do order, you can get the charts and the flosses all with the coupon code. I hope that makes sense. If it didn't make sense and you have questions, just put them down below and I will keep an eye on those so I can reach back out to people. So hashtag strawberry fair sell starting Tuesday, February 14th, so that we can try and get it done uh, for springtime. Hope you can join me. Um, I've actually already posted something to that hashtag, so if you want to follow the hashtag, it's kind of created. I don't really know my hashtag lingo. Um, that's it. All right, uh, I'll be back probably next week with a regular video, but there's all the specifics for you, so happy shopping.